I died for you on the cross, but you won't have ten minutes for me. God is saying to you today, when God says be still, he means be still internally. He wants you to keep pushing forward patiently and with a calm spirit, knowing that he is working everything out for your good. It's difficult to shift the way we think, especially when our habits of wording are deeply rooted. But we will never truly grow or experience the fullness of our encounters with God until we let go of the anxious need to know and control everything. If you'd have a believing God, like this video. If you have a believing God, there is always enough. What have you been worrying about that is simply draining your energy? Can you trust God today to provide for everything you need? He is always on time. Think for your life. Have there been times when you were worried about something and it ended up working out? Thank God for his faithfulness. He hasn't changed. Don't get discouraged. Type, I am evolving to affirm. God is saying to you today, when you have setbacks, disappointments, people coming against you, a negative medical report, don't get discouraged. That's a sign that you're moving towards your finish line. The enemy was fine when you got started, but when you began to make progress, you got his attention. That's when he threw out some obstacles and challenges. Were you confused in as he thought you would give up after the first few difficulties? He thought you'd get discouraged when that friend turned on you, when you lost that client, when your child got in trouble. But instead, you kept moving forward, thanking me that I am in control, thanking me for fighting your battles, saying every morning, no weapon formed against me will prosper. Because of this, I will go before you in open doors, no man can shut, and shower you with blessings, healing and breakthroughs. The best is yet to come. You'll be just fine. It's time to stop doubting yourself so much. You are still very strong. It's just a load you're carrying currently is really heavy. It's time today to reevaluate what are the things weighing you down and get them off of you. This post is for any of you who've been through it, going through it, or got through it. Keep your head up, stay blessed, and stay positive. Type 1010. Type 1010 if you have believed in Jesus' lore. Your story is about to change so epically, it's going to make your heart and head spin. All the time and effort you put in mastering yourself, it's about to satisfyingly pay off. The way your journey has been set up is a pure work of art. This next breakthrough is going to confirm that every ounce of magic in you is about to triple in size. Take a second to enjoy the present moment. It won't be this way for much longer. You're approaching the final steps of the tunnel, but you're slowly realizing that the light you were chasing at the end of it always stems from within you. Be at peace. Your next chapter is going to leave a permanent smile on your face and a lifetime of joy in your soul. Support our community and donate us through Super Thanks. Support our community and donate us through Super Thanks. Type yes if you believe in God. God bless you.